वेलकम टू एन एम ई आई सी टी साक्षत ई कंटेंट प्रोजेक्ट अंडर मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एच आर डी गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया दिस प्रोजेक्ट इज ऑफ मार्केटिंग मैनेजमेंट द प्रोजेक्ट इज अंडर एन एम ई आई सी टी दैट इज नेशनल मिशन ऑन एजुकेशन थ्रू इंफॉर्मेशन एंड कम्युनिकेशन टेक्नोलॉजी अंडर दिस मिशन अ प्रोपर बैलेंस बिटवीन कंटेंट जनरेशन research in critical areas relating to imparting of education and connectivity for integrating our knowledge with the advancement in other countries is to be attempted in order to bolster our knowledge resources to obtain and maintaining the competitive edge in the world we require a system of identification and nurturing of talent and lifelong learning knowledge modules based on personalized needs of the learner would need to be delivered to him or her at the right time with the right content interactively to take care of his or her aspirations with these objectives in mind these videos are created for the portal saksham we will learn basic marketing over here Hi, I am LL Means Learner. I am learner of marketing management. I learn marketing in master's class. The desire for learning marketing comes out of interest. This is very interesting topic. Marketing management is seen everywhere in the society. You see up or down, you see here and there, you can see brand names and logos and advertisements and people working in marketing area. I am very much interested in learning marketing. Let us learn marketing from Dr. J. Bedayani. He is going to teach marketing management under Sikshat E Content Development Project under National Mission on Education through Information and Communication Technology that means N M E I C T. Let us start learning. Good morning to all. Today We are going to learn publicity. Hello and welcome to Sakshat E Content on Marketing Management. Today we are going to learn publicity and public relations. Public relations concerns about building good relations of company with customers, suppliers, dealers, distributors. and at large extend with the society and public first assembly of uh, public uh, relations association in 1987 defined public relations practice as the art of social science in analyzing trends predicting their consequences counseling organization leaders and implementing planned programs of action which serve both the organizations and the public's interest the old name of public relations was publicity which was seen simply as activities to promote a company or its products by planning news about it in media not paid by the marketers public relations involves a variety of programs designed to promote protect a company's image or its individual products public relations is having much wider boundaries than publicity public relations include publicity as well as many other activities public relation departments use many different tools like public relations or press agency creating and releasing newsworthy information in the media to attract attention then product publicity that is what is publicizing specific products then public affairs that is what is building and uh, maintaining local national and international relations then lobbying lobbying is building and maintaining relations with legislators and government officials to influence legislations and regulations then investor relations maintaining relationship with shareholders and others in the financial community is also required over here and then development 
public relations with members of non-profit organizations to gain financial or volunteer support is included in development. Public relations must be sensitive to two general types of public, internal and external. Internal publics are the people who are already connected with an organization and with whom the organization normally communicates in the ordinary routine of work. Typical internal publics in an industry are the employees, stockholders, suppliers, dealers, customers and plant neighbors. For example, employees want good wages and working condition of working conditions opportunities for advancement and a secure retirement customers want a dependable supply of quality products provided at a fair price and supported by convenient services stakeholders want dividends growths and a fair return on their investment external publics are composed of people who are not necessarily closely connected with a particular organization. For example, member of the press, educators, government officials or the clergy, mayor may not have an interest in an industry. For example, members of the press, educators, or government officials may not have an interest in an industry. The leaders of the industry cannot assume any automatic interest and to some extent must choose whether to communicate with these groups or not. Now let us look to objectives of public relations. There are basically three objectives of public relations. Number one, to create as well as retain goodwill. Number two, to promote product, people and organization. Number three, to build up good corporate image in the minds of stakeholders of the company. Well, public relations can have a strong impact on public awareness at much lower cost than advertising. The company does not pay for the space or time in the media Rather, it pays for a staff to develop and circulate information and to manage events. If the company develops an interesting story, it could be picked up by several different media, having the same effect at, as advertising that would cost a lot more money and it would have more credibility than advertising, obviously. Well, there are several advantages of publicity and public relations. We can say in points that number one, increase the profile of your organization. Number two, it improves brand awareness. Number three, updates the public about your recent activities. Number four, attracts and impress people. For example, funders, those who are funding agencies and business partners next it gives you the opportunity to spread your message next promotes better mental health awareness well etc it can be endless it can be a number of advantages but we have seen the major advantages over here there are several tools which public relations use the major tools in public relations are Publications, publications, well, organizations can rely extensively on published materials to reach and influence their target market. These include annual reports, brochures, articles, company newsletters and magazines and audiovisual materials. Next is events. Marketers can draw attention to new products or other company activities by arranging special events like product launching events, news conferences, seminars, trade shows, 
exhibitions, contests and competitions and anniversaries that will reach the target public. Well, well, well. Over here, the major example is Apple, which goes for organizing many, many events for public uh, launch of uh, iPhone and iPads and uh, MacBooks and etc. Next is sponsorship. Companies can promote their brands and corporate name by sponsoring sports and cultural events and highly regarded causes. Well, uh, Microsoft AIDS sponsorship is very well known throughout the world. Then news. Creating favorable news about the company, its products and its people and getting media attention through press conferences. That is what is creation of news. News creation is a major topic uh, for journalists. It's a it's, uh, topic which even marketers should study. Then speeches. Increasingly, company executives must field questions from the media or give talks at trade associations or sales meetings and these appearances can build the company's image. Definitely yes. Then public service activities. Companies can build goodwill by contributing money and time to good causes. Definitely yes. Obviously, companies should do this. And then identity media. Companies need a visual identity that the public immediately recognizes. The visual identity is carried by company logos, stationery, brochures, signs, business forms, business cards, buildings, uniforms, dress codes, etc. So you can say this were the major tools of public relations. We have studied about public relations over here. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for the class and watching. I have learned a lot. Did you? Have a good day from the learner.